Natasha here from Start a School Crochet. This week's, this week's Stitch Explorer tutorial is called the Peacock Stitch. This stitch is really beautiful. It has a lot of fan. It's like a little fans coming out. Kind of looks like a peacock tail. And it's a simple pattern with only two stitches. So that's great for a beginner to learn how to do the treble stitch. So I'm using a 4.5 millimeter hook and ship is in the colorway of 815. And it works in multiples of 10. Plus one is what the pattern calls for, but for some reason, I seem to be a little bit off and maybe it was just me, but maybe you wanna try with um, multiples of 10 plus two, just to see if that helps. You can see if you guys ran into the same problem I did. All right, guys, full pattern is written on my blog, and let's get started. To start, we're going to do a, found, or a chain of 20. So you start off with a slip knot, and then chain one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. So I've got 20, any multiple of 10 plus one. So I'm gonna add one more. So I'll have a total of 21 chains. So to start off the row one, we're going to work a single crochet into the second chain from the hook here. Then we're going to skip four chains. So that's one, two, three, and four. And we're gonna work nine trebles into the fifth chain. So nine, a treble is your yarn over twice, insert your hook into the stitch, grab and pull up. You'll have four on your hook, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over and pull through two until you have just one loop on your hook. And you repeat that nine times into the same chain, which is quite a bit. So pause the video and we'll come back after we finish our nine. Say, so there's our nine. The next step is to skip four chains and then we'll single crochet into the next chain. So because this kind of bunches things up a little bit, make sure you actually get your, your chain isn't hiding. So it looks like this is gonna be my next chain even though that one kind of looks like it is. So I'm gonna skip one, two, three, and four, and then we're single crochet into the fifth one. Then you're gonna skip four, one, two, three, and four, and work nine trebles into that next one. Okay, so I've come to the end here, and as you can see by looking at it, it looks like I just have four stitches left, but the pattern calls to skip four and single crochet into the last one. But like I said before, don't get a little confused because when you do these nine trebles, it really pulls the chain. So actually my fourth one is right there. So go ahead and skip those four chains, one, two, three, and four, and then single crochet into the last. Like that. There we have two little shells, or peacock. So for row like two, what we're gonna do first is chain four, turn your work, and then we're gonna treble into the very first stitch. No fail, somebody's gonna run a power, power tool while I'm doing my tutorials. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Okay, so after you do your treble, these are actually gonna count as two trebles and you'll see throughout the pattern. Um, you're gonna chain three. And then we're gonna skip four of our trebles. One, two, three, and four. And we're gonna work a single crochet into the fifth one. Then we chain three, skip four, 
trebles, one, two, three, and four. And then this single crochet here, we're gonna work two trebles. So it kind of raises it up to the level of the rest of the shells. And after we do that, we're gonna chain three. Skip four trebles, one, two, three, and four, and then work a single into the top of the fifth treble. Then you're gonna chain three, skip the four, one, two, three, and four, and then we're gonna work two trebles into that last single crochet. Oops, I don't think I yarned over twice. So there we have our one. Got to do one more. There we go. So that's the end of our row two. This is going to be the beginning of our repeat. So we're gonna repeat rows two and three. So we just finished row two. Now we'll move on to row three. So chain one, turn for row three. We're gonna single crochet Oh, into the chain space between the two trebles. So go in between the two and chain, I mean single crochet. And then we're going to skip the three chain and work nine trebles into this single crochet on top of the other set of trebles. So let's pause the video here and then create your nine, because the trebles take a long time. I've completed the nine, and after we complete the nine, we're going to work a single crochet into the center of the trebles, and then go straight over, skip the chain three, and work nine more into the center of that single crochet. Now we're at the end and we're going to work um, a single crochet into the between the treble and the churning chain here. Like that. So that's our row, row three completed. So what you do here after this is you just repeat rows two and row three until you reach your desired height. So it's a really easy pattern and it creates really nice a nice um, little peacock fan look to it all right guys I hope you enjoyed this tutorial please leave any comments below if you have questions hit the subscribe button and the little bell to get notified of future stitch tutorials and I hope you guys have a great weekend happy crocheting